Maria Fueras is one of the family who is working with us. And before I started to enjoy the program, it was so hard for her to feed the, their children. She's a widow. Uh, she had a really hard time because her husband died. Antes, yo, cuando ya se enfermó mi marido, yo vivía en el hospital año cuatro meses con mi marido. Había tenido tumores en la cabeza. Y ahí, cuida, que se sana, que se sana. Yo, cuida, cuida. Tenía los guauitos, tres guauitos ahí. Después ya se murió. Me quedé sin nada. Me tocó ahí ayudar a cualquier persona para que me den un centavito. Un sucre ganaba en día. Ese sucre no me alcanzaba para comprar cualquier cosita para los guaguas. Y me tocó trabajar, dejar a los guaguas encargando o encerrando en mi cuarto para ir a buscar cualquier comidita. Hace ya los cambios que ya me dijeron que ya hay ahí este proyecto. Eh, yo estaba contento, ojalá me ayuden. Y me, ya me mandaron unas papitas que siembre, siembre, alberjitas, dijo que siembre, siembre, coseché y ahora tengo la semilla para sembrar otra vez. Y los animalitos lo mismo, criaron, vendí, otra vez compré, así estoy dando las vueltas. Part of the, the beauty of the SRI program is that when they don't have food, they can simply go out into their, their farm and pick something and bring it back to the household. Whereas if you're, if you're working a cash crop, you've got to wait until you're paid for that cash crop. Raising their income is nice, but what's more important is, is having that income translate into something meaningful for productivity's sake. And I think that's one of the better things about the SRA program is that it's not just looking at income because that's, that's such an unreliable indicator of well-being. There are many families that are, are poor but are extremely happy and well off because they're well fed, because they have a, a decent job that, that doesn't treat them poorly, and, and all of those things are met by the SRA program. The farmers can work their own land, have a feeling that they're actually growing something for their family, and they're not getting squeezed by middlemen on either side in their selling of their crops and the buying of the, the food back from the market. It's the whole package in the sense that they're, they're both growing and eating their food and so they're a real productive, self-sufficient economic unit as a household. Sí me ha cambiado bastante. Estoy contenta. Antes no tenía que comer. Ahora sí estoy feliz. Antes no tenía, por eso andaba llorando. Pero ahora estoy feliz, contenta, que gracias a Dios me ha apoyado este, este apoyo. Sí, estoy contenta. Dios le pague. Ah.